Hi everyone, this is my complete Molly Happy Train series. Complete as in including all the secrets. Okay, I'm just going to show you all the characters one by one. So first, we have number one. Number one is a secret. It's called Secret Painter. So you have Molly with her green berry and green eyes. Wearing a lanyard with an M. And because she's a painter, you have splotches of paint all around on her clothes. And she's wearing uh, red shoes. And she's sitting on cube number one. Okay. Just rotate a bit, let you see how she looks from behind. Yep. Okay, so that's number one. Secret painter. So on cube number two, there are two of them. Okay, this is Princess Molly Pink. Okay, yeah, pink because she's wearing a pink set of clothes and she has a huge pink crown on top of her. Yeah, I wonder if it's too heavy for her. Because <laughs> this crown is huge. Okay, so she's barefoot and sitting on the pink number two cube. Okay. Next I have Princess Molly Blue. Oops, to cover her face. So this is a blue number two cube. So you have the same outfit except it is in blue this time. Blue crown, striped blue clothes. Looks a bit like pajamas but very pretty still. Oops, don't fall. Oh, these are really fragile. As in, they are prone to falling like a domino effect. Okay, number three is chocolate. Killer chocolate Molly. <laughs> okay, so she's in black clothes with yellow boots. Her yellow dress got splotches of chocolate. She killed some chocolate, I guess. And her makeup is like that of a clown. It's like a clown face, her eyes are red, her nose is red, her lips are red, you know, and they have all these clown marks on the face. And she has this cute collar with a lot of black splotches. Hmm, not brown though. So it's part of her outfit. Okay, and she has a cute golden crown. Okay, it's smaller than the ones the princesses are wearing. <laughs> okay, killer chocolate molly. Trying my best not to make them fall. Okay, I'll put number one here so that I can access the rest easily. Okay, and the next yellow number three cube is Killer Tomato Molly. Okay, so she has the same yellow base clothes like the Killer Chocolate one, except it has red splotches. Red for tomato. <laughs> so her Hair is all red. She has a yellow crown. Her sleeves are black and red stripe. Yeah, and her collar is actually pure white. No splotches at all. Not bad. She managed to keep it clean. And she's wearing red boots. Okay, I have a BJD that looks exactly like this. <laughs> yeah, I got it before I got this set. Then I was like, hey! This is the same as my BJD, except this is in figurine form. And the BJD actually has a secret. If you get the secret, you'll get it in the brown color, brown and black color design. Next, we come to number four. Number four is Space Molly Brown. Hmm. A space suit. Oh! Yeah, she has the gas canisters, the AB canisters, and it looks like it's set to fly. It's like a jetpack for her. Her space suit is brown. She has the ears. Remind me of... Is it Painter Molly in the Space Molly series? Yeah, where they have the ears like this. 
Okay, so this is Space Molly Brown. So you can guess what the next one is, right? Space Molly Pink! Because her outfit is totally pink! The only difference between this Space Molly and the Mega Space Molly is that the Mega Space Molly has that um, glass that can be shifted down to cover the face. I mean, I think it's plastic, uh, but it's supposed to be some glass covering the face uh, to protect it when you're in space. Okay. And these two don't have guns. Space Molly all have guns. Okay, this is Space Molly Pink. Next are two ladies that you might have seen in my Pop Mart haul videos. We have the Red Stewardess, Molly Red Stewardess. She's sitting on a blue number five with her Red Stewardess outfit. Red top, blue skirt with her cute red hat and a striped scarf. Then we have the blue stewardess who's wearing a light yellow top with a blue skirt and a blue hat. Okay, this one, the Molly has black hair. The other one is the usual blonde. Her shoes are blue also, matching with the rest of her outfit. Next, we're moving on to number six. So this is Singer Molly Blue. This one is so pretty. Black hair, green eyes. Look at the fish on her dress. This dress is called a Chong Sam. It's a Chinese traditional dress. Very elegant. Okay. So I guess she's a Chinese singer. <laughs> she has this is not blue, this is purpley. Yeah, but the description says singer Molly Blue. Okay. Yeah. Looks purple to me. She has purple shoes on. Yeah, but it match her dress. Any guesses as to what this singer is called? <laughs> this is actually called Singer Molly White. Even though her dress is beige, yeah, beige color, slightly creamy, slightly pink, yeah, mixture of colors here. Peach, lah. her shoes are peach color. Her flower is also peach color. Okay, and if you notice, both the Singer Mollies have black hair. This one, the dress has some cherry blossom design on it. Well, the other one is a fish. Very elegant looking. Very cute. Okay, last pair is Ocean Girl Molly Blue and Green. So we have blue and green. Okay, we start with blue first. So her dress is kind of purpley, not so blue, but it's the same purple as the singer Molly. She has a red goggles. Are these goggles? Diving goggles, maybe? Yeah, I'm not sure of the correct term for it, but these are to protect her when she goes into the ocean. Okay, she's she has her head in a scarf that she's tied up behind. Ocean Girl Molly Green. Okay, so this one is more dark blue than green. Her pants are green. Her diving goggles are green. The Tiffany green that we like, that they like to use. Yep, Ocean Girl Molly Green. Both of them are on number seven cubes. Last but not least, are the trains. Okay. This one is a green train. This is a red train. Okay. This one, I will set up. 
I'm not sure how, how I'm going to set up the train. Um, I can only have one of it dragging the whole uh, train full of mollies and not two. So maybe they'll take turns. Yeah. So that one I will do in a picture. Okay, because... And yeah, maybe I'll put it into a shots to show you guys. Because... <laughs> The mollies tend to fall <laughs> easily when they're not on stable ground, you know, not on a flat surface. Okay, so these two trains are really cute. The color contrast is very nice. The red and black, the green and pink. Okay, and they both have Kenny's work on it. Kenny's work will go. Yep. Because Molly is by Kenny's work. Yep. Okay. Thank you for watching this video and listening to me review my set of Molly Happy Train. I hope you liked it. I think some of these can still be found online, but not in the shops. I haven't seen it in the shops anywhere. Maybe on display only, yeah. Right, thank you all. Please continue to like and for those who haven't subscribed, just hit that subscribe button and help me out. See you in my next video. Bye!